Hey, what's up, YouTube, and welcome back to another CD Tweaks video. In today's video, I have some tweaks to share with you guys. Some of those tweaks will be still working on iOS 12, and some of them they already has been updated right now to work with the new jailbreak, the J Crane jailbreak iOS 13, and these will be work up to 13.2.3. So before I'm going to be start today's video, let me ask you guys to give the video a big thumbs up. Also, make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever I release a new CDA Tweaks video. Hey, what's up, guys, and welcome back, and happy new year to all of you guys. Okay, so number one on my list, the first one will be called you try not shut down so this is for your device shutdown so you guys can take a look right now here let me show you if i want to shut down my device what is going to happen so you guys can take a look right now that the only message that i have is the dismiss here so this is what the pretty much that week it's all about it won't let your device to be shut down unless you give your device a notification or you customize that from under the settings. I'm about to show you guys right now and jump under the settings here to show you what we have here. So once you download the tweak, go ahead, enable the tweak. You can play around with your alert. You can play with your title text. You can see it right now here. So each single section has the enable toggle. Go ahead and toggle that. And then also we have the message text here. You can take a look at it. It comes with the enable button here. And then here is the dismiss text. So you can switch that the way you like. Also, you can just stop on it here right now. You can delete that right away. And then you can add anything you would like to. So this is what the uh, tweak it's all about. So once you're down, if you want to do some configuration stuff from under the settings, as I show you guys, you need to make sure to resupring your device. So your device will be take the effect. And this is the way about that week once you install it in your jello broken device once again as i told you guys this one will be called you try not shut down moving right now to talking about the next one and the next one it is a theme if you want to resupring your device with that theme so the name for this one will be the ctos resupring the top one here that i have so you guys can see right now that i already enabled this one and let me show you guys the style if I want to resupring my device. So you guys can take a look right now. This is the style once you want to enable that theme or the resupring theme from the snowboard. It will be just like that. So this is the way about the uh, CTOS resupring, how it's going to be looks like. As I told you guys, go ahead and use the snowboard, any other themer you already download in your smartphone. Go ahead and use your themer, enable that resupring, and it will be giving you that style in your uh, iDevice once you want to resupring in your iDevice. So once again, this one will be called the CTOS resupring. Okay, so the next one on my list will be the top left folder dots. This will be, once you download a tweak, this will be place the dots at the top left once you want to launch any one of the folders in your smartphone. To be honest, once I download the tweak, it didn't show me any kind of dots here. It might because there is another tweak that I download affect this one. But I already, once I download the tweak, I take a screenshot to make sure you guys understand what is that tweak will be for and how it's going to be looks like. So you guys can take a look right now here that the both dots right now here will be at the left, top left, right there, just like that. So once I download this one, as I told you guys, uh, just go ahead and launch any kind of folder inside your smartphone. It didn't show me the same method here. And I do believe this one will be work with iOS 13, but I'm sure that there is another tweak affect this one once I try to make this one working on my iDevice. But at least you guys right now have an idea what is that tweak will be for. And once again, if you guys are looking to bring this one into your smartphone, as I told you, this one will be called the top left folder dots. 
So moving right now and talking about the next one on my list. And the next one will be the Tiny Benaros 2. This one right now it's working for the both iOS 12 and iOS 13. This is the style here and even you can customize that style from under the settings. So that is a bunch of stuff right now. If you want to go ahead and configure those from under the settings, you can play around. First of all, go ahead and enable the tweak and then you can play around with the mods. You can play around with the extra tiny notification if you want to. You can snap that to the status bar if you want to. You can change that or the UI settings. You can play all those settings. There is some extra uh, sliders here to adjust the way of the notification in your iDevice scrolling text if you want to enable or bring this one into your jailbroken device so once you receive any kind of notification once that notification pop up in your status bar it will becomes a scrolling once you receive any kind of notification you can play around with where is that notification coming from so you can bring that from the top from the right for example to the left from the left to the right something like that and then once you're done from all those configuration as i told you guys always you need to make sure to re -spring your device so your device will be take the effect and as i show you guys something will be looks like this tiny banners most of you guys know if you already knew at the jailbreak you need to bring this one will be nice and cool looking for your notification spell especially at the lock screen will be that tiny notification just like that anyway this one will be called the tiny banners 2 let me move right now to talking about the next one and the next one will be called the sneak peek so you guys can take a look right now here i'm on my lock screen but i can take a sneak peek what's going on on my supreme board you guys can take a look right now here let me just go back into my lock screen there is a lock screen right there nothing if you just want to take a sneak peek like that you guys can take a look see just like that take a look what's going on you want to see something you want to see if there is a video you're waiting for or something notification take a sneak peek from your lock screen through your springboard just like that let me show you guys right now what we have under the uh, settings here so there is some uh, a lot of uh, stuff go ahead first of all enable the uh, sneak peek tweak from near the data and time here so you can hide some stuff of course this will be controlled most of the things from your lock screen so you can take a sneak peek through lock screen to see what's going on in your supreme board and also here the blur so you can play around with your blur hide the blur if you want to and there is another section if you want specific will be for the iphone x so you can hide the flashlight you can hide the uh, lock screen camera you can hide the x bar and then you can hide the lock beta if you already download this one once you've done it from all those configuration you need to make sure to apply all the changes and this is the way about that week once again it is a cool stuff if you want to bring that uh, tweak into your smartphone and take a sneak peek see what's going on in your supreme board anyway guys this is the most tweak that i have for you guys in today's video in today's update so i hope you guys enjoy today's video i hope you guys enjoy most the tweaks that i show you already so if you guys like the video make sure to give the video a big thumbs up also make sure to subscribe hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever i release a new cd tweaks video catch you with the next one peace out